<laughs> good morning good morning god bless you uh, i hope you are well <clears throat> the lord is good uh, this is the day that the lord hath made and we will rejoice and be glad in it you know the lord is so faithful you know no matter what we're going through the Lord is with us. We have to take it that, you know what, when we're actually going through uh, that tough situation, it is because, you know, God is actually, okay, let me put it this way. The Lord um, has allowed, you know, that situation uh, to occur, but the Lord is full of mercy. Sorry, I'm just trying to sort my hair out. The Lord is uh, full of mercy, you know, for us, of love, of compassion, of, of everything good, good plans for us. And so in those moments when we're going through some, you know, difficult situations, we need to be waiting upon the Lord. We need to be thanking the Lord. We need to be looking unto him. We need to still be in his presence, be uh, in his secret place, be in his pavilion. We need to have run to him, you know, all along. Um, and so one of the things I needed to talk today about is about how, you know, um, the Lord has given us, you know, the ability to create wealth. Maybe some people, they could laugh. Do you know what? I do not care less. Um, I don't know if, if, if that's a wrong language, may God forgive me and I'll, I'll take it off. But the thing is. I wouldn't, if anyone was like that, you know what? Glory be to the Lord because we are moving. And these are the people who, you know, um, because, you know, they, they will be proved wrong. They are proven wrong even now, you know. And so we need to know that as children of God, God has given us the ability to create wealth, you know. And one thing I needed to mention is about how we need to be able uh, to not despise humble beginnings. You know, some of of, 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 of people, you know, they, they don't like humble beginnings. They would, they would just like to be on the, you know, doing something big and, and all that. You need to start from somewhere. You know, it's from somewhere, you have to have a testimony. You know, God raising you from the dungeon, from the ground, raising you up and, you know, setting, you know, um, your feet upon the rock. You need to have a testimony. You know, it is important because, I mean, how if you are there, call it at the top, you're there at the top. You just don't know where you've come from. You've got no comprehension of how God has helped you and how he's helping you. How are you going to be able to help other people? How are you going to be able to explain to other people that this is where or what God has done or is doing for us? You know, this is, you know, you, how can you be able to explain to people who are in those moments you know, on the ground, suffering, you know, downcasted. How can you be able to encourage them that, you know what, even though you are there, but you know what, with God, all things are possible. God is able to answer your prayers. How can you do that if you are despising humble beginnings? And so today I just need to encourage everyone <clears throat> that, you know what, whatever you've got, whatever you've got, life, I mean, that's hope. There is a hope for a tree that has been cut. What more with you who has got life? You know, and so I I just speak life into uh, existence, you know, for every dry bone. You know, I prophesy for every dry bone, you know, uh, to receive the breath of life. For every dry bone to, to come back together with whichever bone is supposed to come back together to and for the breath of life you know uh, to be renewed restored to the lost hope in the mighty name of jesus i'm telling you i'm speaking into existence you know the word of god talks about silver and gold is mine any silver and gold that is in the wrong hand <laughs> I, I speak the word of god let there be light let silver and god be in our hands, in the hands of, you know, of God's people, in the mighty name of Jesus. We, pre we, we plead for mercy, you know, um, <clears throat> for our God, 
you know, uh, to continue, you know, to have mercy upon us. We bless his name. We magnify his name. In the mighty name of our Lord Jesus Christ, we pray and we worship him and we love him with all our hearts, with all our soul, with all our strength, with all our mind in the mighty name of Jesus. And we love one another, you know, in the mighty name of Jesus. And don't forget to love yourself. Okay. Love you so much. Bye-bye.